Hello everyone! How's it going out there guys? I picked up some new Hot Wheels. They're brand new in the package, but they're vintage. And uh, these were found at an uh, antique mall. I have a Plymouth GTX, 1971 Plymouth uh, GTX, and a 69 Dodge Charger 500. Let's get them out of the package. I'll show you everything, the car nice and close up. And we can take a look at the packaging as well. Find out more about these. This is a little hard to open there. There's a little little insert there that kind of holds the car in place. There we go. And let's open this one. Ooh, we gotta be careful with this. That's why I never do these on camera. I realized I forgot to open them up because it's dangerous. You got to be really careful when you open these. So let's start with this uh, yellow Honey Nut Cheerios. I love Honey Nut Cheerios. I eat plenty of those. So here it is, Cereal Crunchers 4 of 5 Plymouth GTX. And here he is, out of the package. There's the top view. I love the GTX, such a cool car. Side view, here's the back end. And here's the left left side. And over here the front view. And let's get close up there. As we can see, we have a nice chrome grill on this one. Chrome headlights. There's something going on down here, a little uh, grill on, in yellow and maybe a couple of lights down there. We have the five spokes in chrome. Honey Nut Cheerios logo here on the side with some flames. I go all the way to the back. Check out the back fender. Plymouth GTX, a big orange stripe with the black stripes. Very cool. This one is like a glossy yellow color. And it does have a couple of bucket seats in there. You can see, there we go. See the bucket seats in there left side driver no mirrors on the side of this car this one this one was uh, put out and let's check out the card real quick 2003 so maybe somewhere around 2003 2004 and this is what I paid for this one at the antique mall Cereal Crunchers. And here it says 2004. Number 116. Pretty cool. I like it. I have a few GTX and I really like this uh, this car. I like how they look together, all the uh, different colors. I have a few others. Very cool. On the back end, we just have the chrome going on. Spot for the license plate. No colors on the uh, lights or anything like that. And then on the base, let's see what we have on the base. We have, looks like two pipes showing back here. For the exhaust, you can see the separation right there. This one comes from Thailand. 71 Plymouth GTX down here. Strange not to see a Hot Wheels logo on the base of one of the cars. But this one's been out for a long time, sitting in that package. <laughs> oh, there's a Hot Wheels logo in there. See that? I think it's on the glass, like etched in the glass. Pretty interesting. And then the giant Honey Nut Cheerios. So this looks like it was a cereal series of five. This one's number four of five. Cereal Crunchers. I don't think I have any of these uh, cereal crunchers in my collection. I might not remember, but I do have some old ones from about these years or about from the 2000s. I have some put away that I've found here and there. And then over here I have a really cool 
69 Dodge Charger 500 in metallic blue with a white stripe on the back the Dodge name very cool nice graphics on the card on this one where they actually match the car 50 year celebration of the 426 Hemi and then they have this Hot Wheels showdown thing that you can do online and you have a little QR code there 1964 to 2014 the copyright on this one is 2013 and also a little high priced here 425 but it's one of those things you just want to get something sometimes that you like you pay the price <laughs> hot wheel seed uh, hot wheel city series a little blue stripe there light blue and pretty nice card and here we go a nice dodge charger 500 looks like we have the same wheels as the other one this wheel's not even spinning what's up with that this one's moving good that one's kind of like stuck there it has something i don't know this one's doing good this one's doing good yep <laughs> we got a dud wheel and we do have some uh parking lights on this one we have a nice uh 50 year celebration on the door there a couple of bucket seats inside no mirrors on the side on this uh, model or casting and then we have the uh same kind of details in the back as the other one just the uh, chrome everything chromed out chrome on the bottom plastic chrome base copyrighted 2014 made in malaysia we do have the hot wheels logos on, on this one g30 marked on the base there 69 dodge charger 500 very cool we do have the two little exhaust things happening right there you can see back there I like this with the blue and the white stripe very nice and the big 500 there on the back Hot Wheels logo on this side same thing and then they both have the door handles painted in silver with the little decals there or little tampos I have some vents here lines very nice all the little details on the hood the front end all chromed out just like the back end but this is a beautiful blue here's a top view so nice so these are brand new out of the package but they're not new they've been put away for a long time and now being sold at the uh, antique mall wonder what's up with that wheel still moves pretty good yeah still moving back and forth <laughs> let's see yeah they go about the same speed just with a little tap let's compare these side by side here we go top view looks like the charger is just a tad or a little bit uh, longer than the than the GTX here's the front view on these babies and the little head-to-head -head here so nice bam bam very cool and let's check out the side uh, the back side back to back I should say <laughs> back to back I like the big fat tires in the back nice uh, big fat tires Plymouth GTX and a 69 Dodge Charger 500 1971 GTX 69 Charger so they're about two years apart it looks like the uh, charger is a little wider than the GTX. Let's see how they look uh, side by side here. 
these are pretty neat. You never know what you're going to find out there. Sometimes at the flea market. The other day at the flea market, they had so many cool cars. I wanted to buy so many. And, uh, and then I run into these two. And they're so cool. Very nice. Very nice. These are awesome. So what do you think of these guys? Do you have these in your collection? Have you ever seen them before? Or is it something new? They're all new to me. <laughs> Had never seen these uh, particular colors before in these castings. It's kind of cool. Wasn't really looking for them or anything like that. Just happened to like them. Awesome. All right, guys, I want you to remember that every day I have new videos on the channel. So come back tomorrow, the next day, whatever, and check out some more diecast cars. I'm always showing diecast cars on my channel. Every day, new videos. So I have daily videos. Uh, please, if you can, hit that like button down there. Little thumbs up down there somewhere. There's a little thumbs up. Hit that little like button. Maybe we can get this video up to 15 likes today. That would be so awesome. And I thank you for helping me out and supporting the channel. Thank you so much, guys. It's great to read your comments, so leave some more comments. Let me know what's going on in your collecting world. Or just talk about these cars. How do you like the GTX? Are you a fan of the Dodge? Let me know. So cool to talk to you guys and at least uh, read the comments and see what's going on in your world. Very interesting. And remember, when you share it with me, you're sharing it with other guys who are reading the comments. So it's pretty cool. And uh, sometimes we get a little conversation going about something. It's pretty nice. All right, guys, it's great to uh, to read your comments, so don't forget, just say hello or something about the cars or your collection. And uh, another thing, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Down there is a little red button that says subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Help me keep growing the channel and get this uh, channel out into the universe of YouTube, the YouTube universe. Thanks, guys, for helping out, and I hope you enjoy my videos. Enjoy checking out all the cars. I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video.